Hello, hello, hello everybody. Welcome to today's video. What's going on? Well, we're gonna jump back into the garage and we're gonna do some Jetta things. Some Jetta things. It's been a while um, since I was able to work on the car, just because of being busy, work, all of these things. But yes, or this weekend I went to Tuna Revolution in Chicago. If you guys haven't watched that video, I'll drop a link to it like now on the screen. Like, ooh, hooray, and also probably below in the links. Um, and I was so excited to see all so many cool cars, and it just got me re-motivated to get back in the garage, finish this car up, get it going, get it driving, do some more videos for you guys, do some more videos for me, and then start thinking about the next vehicle, because I really, really, really want to do something in the Japanese, the JDM world. I just am so just drawn to everything there that, you know, Jetta needs to keep, he needs to get going. I need to figure out what I want to do with it, whether if I keep it or do something cool and unique with it, or just like keep it as my daily. But more Jetta videos are happening. But let's jump into the garage. Um, today we are going to do a few different things. The first thing that we're going to do is start working on cleaning up the block. This is something that Led told me I was supposed to do like a few weeks ago. I just haven't got down to it, unfortunately. But at least the garage is perfectly clean right now. So I'm going to roll the block out of the on the driveway and I'm going to go at it with some metal brushes and try to get like the surface rust off of it so then we can prime it and get it ready for paint and then start assembling it. We are like a few weeks away from having a Jetta that runs again. So that's pretty damn exciting. So let's, uh, let's head to the garage. Okay, so pull the engine out. Boom engine there's a few things that i need to pull off still um from there i think that's the only two things that i need to pull off and this one two three and then from there we're gonna start knocking all of this rust off see this just like comes off it's gross oh Ew. And I pulled this out of my garage because I just feel like it's gonna be easier to clean it up this way. So let's uh, let's get cleaning. Step one, coat the bitch. Mmm, penetrating oil. So, safety goggles. Here comes the fun part. Look at it. Obviously I can't do two things at once, but this is gonna be a lot of fun. This camera's constantly. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's nice. I could see you doing a slow mo shot of it with like oh. some, some weird like vocal uh, EDM. Oh, oh. Mm. oh. I need some like a low grade porn soundtrack. Yeah. Bounce Chicago. Oh, yeah. That's what EDM samples are. They're just slowed down a little bit and like, you know, they put a bunch of reverb on them. So all, all the vocals are is people just saying oh or like yeah. Yeah, or, baby. Do they still talk about the night in electronic music? Probably. Okay. That's usually when you want to listen to electronic music, right? You no, know, I listen to it midday. Mm. Like like heat of the afternoon, mm. I some EDM, and, and I think about like love. Life, love. <laughs> that one time I had a bad trip in Mexico. <laughs>
Hello everyone, we are back working on the Jetta. There was a little break in between yesterday um, and to today. And I, what I did was went and bought an actual drill that plugs in. The ones that we had kept killing the batteries. So we have that. And look at the progress we've made. Look at this. This is like so much better than what it was. So much better. When you look at like this side, garbage this side so the goal today is to first also look at the shirt hogwarts is sick the goal today is get this to the point where it needs to dry um everything's gonna be cleaned off of it and then hopefully tomorrow we can take off the oil pan and potentially start painting it i'm pretty damn excited so let's get back to cleaning all right so i've been doing this for a while Kind of tired of it. I know I need to take this plate off. So, we're gonna start doing that. See if we're gonna be successful. Um, I kind of have an idea of what I'm doing, kind of. I know that these bolts need to come off and then behind that there's gonna be more bolts. Uh, and then hopefully this entire thing just comes straight off. Yeah, let's try that. Check this out. I realize all of this is connected. I just forgot, and I think it's kind of cool. And you turn this, so I was trying to take this off, but then I was seeing all these bubbles. That's kind of fun. That's kind of it. I mean, Wait, you and I clutch at? dumped that car how many it's times? Off the old engine. Off that, huh? No, off this one. So Yeah, that's not what well, his engine. It's the new engine. What's wrong with this? That's Just like the other side. That's the new motor? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh. You see how... Well, look, one's pink, one's not. You see how there's all that hot spots? Yeah. Yeah, heat. that's heat. Oh. And my fingers are greasy now. I don't care what your girlfriend says about you, you're a fucking winner. Fear <laughs> gunner? Yeah. I can't get out of that. That's fine. Gonna... The moment of glory. So what is all that? Um, All these chunks are broken timing chain guides. Are they supposed to be broken into chunks? No. <laughs> Yeah, but look how clean that looks. 
cleaner than it was. There's still pieces. Progress is next to godliness. Since this chain is fucked anyway, I'm gonna make us all friendship bracelets. This chain is literally... Mm -hmm. Broken? Yeah. Nice. It's one thing to jump guys. timing, it's another thing to snap the chain. <laughs> that was satisfying. <laughs> oh yeah, and then all those parts went into the freaking pan. Oh, that's what Joe was saying. There's something in the pan rattling around. Yeah. yeah. That, makes, that makes a lot yeah. of sense. Yep. It's all fucked. <laughs> you better just be like... Perfect. That's doing its job. Hmm. Everything seems in order. Yep. <laughs> And chain guards are gonna drop right now? Mm, maybe. Oh, wait, that it? looks pretty clean. Is this, wait, is this the old motor or the new motor? No. Oh, that's why I was concerned. Is there anything, did it cause any damage to the metal? When it, when it broke? Timing chain guides? Mm -hmm. so. Everything inside is fine. The ch one of the chains snapped. So I thought I'm it was gonna just drop. Uh, Can you hand me that screwdriver under your knee? Assuming you, like, when you launched it, it just. Uh, you could probably just tap that with a hammer. Firefoot on this edge. Where the fuck did I put the hammer? Firefoot. Like, Firefoot. It's like conveniently placed. Somebody want to grab, like, put a hand under it somewhere? You need a race oil pan or something? What? Huh? You need a different oil pan? Or I already have it. It's a turbo one on top. Oh. Black. Is it nice? Yeah. Fucking should be for 180 bucks. Wow! <laughs> wow! Oh no! <laughs> oh no! That's all plastic, hopefully, right? Yeah, it's all yeah. plastic. <laughs> That's a lot of plastic. Yeah. Or they, I mean, they explode in there, and then the chain just grinds them up. Yeah. That makes sense. After a while, it becomes soup. Oh, what is this? What is what? I don't know what this little device thing is. That's your oil pump. Oh. Wow, that would be a fucking pain in the ass if an oil pump goes. Trying to buy let's, one of those? Let's done three in a day. Ask him about it. That's what you broke? Yeah. I thought you broke like the oil like filter. No. No, no. 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 You smash the, you, you smash the yeah. pan on the, the ground pan, hard enough. The steel pans flex. They hit this and they shatter it, and there's a drive shaft that goes up to the top of the motor. Okay. And sometimes I would just crank it and I would snap the drive shaft for the pump in half. And that block where this connects mm -hmm. has a hairline fracture. Cool. Cool. <laughs> um. That's why I'm asking if I'm gonna fuck on the motorcycle. <laughs> <laughs> no, he hasn't, he hasn't owned it long. So we got some new things today. We got the ECU, 
We got a adapter for the steering wheel, and we got ba 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 going into the car. We got our steering wheel. Look at that. Oh, it's gonna really be dark as shit. I don't want to touch it. My hands are dirty as shit. Look at that. In addition, check out what we did. We dropped the oil pan and started cleaning up the engine even more. Oil pan dropped. Look at all of this plastic. Garbage. So, right now we are, everyone left to go ride motorcycles. I can't ride motorcycles because my wrist is messed up and I'm going to clean this. I'm gonna put it back in the garage and then we're gonna continue doing this either tomorrow or this is gonna be the end of the video. Not quite sure yet. So, I will let you know. All right, let's do this. But one second. Well, hi everybody, it's another day. And not to be confusing, I'm wearing the same t-shirt because it's already dirty and I didn't want to do laundry again. What are we doing today? Well, we're back with the block. Hopefully, I'm going to be spending the next hour or so cleaning everything off. Look at that one. That one was so good. This one, not so good. Not so good, good, good. Kind of good. But that's the ticket. So, I'm going to just be cleaning a bunch right now, and I'm going to stop along the way, and I'm going to give you a little mm, tidbits of life information, more or less. Some philosophy, some thoughts on local politics, the government, things like that. Or I'm just going to start finding a bunch of really dumb childhood jokes, and I'll just sprinkle those throughout the video. So, keep watching. Let's, uh, let's get cleaning. Yo, but actually one thing, what I'm going to be doing while I'm doing this listening, I've been listening to the Game of Thrones soundtrack, Game of Thrones audiobook for the last, basically since May. When I drove out to Colorado with the Ducati, I listened to half of it there, half of it back, and I've been slowly listening to the second book. I'm about like three hours left until this book's done. Um, since I don't drive anywhere, I don't really get a lot of time to like listen to audiobooks and podcasts anymore, which is really weird. Uh, like habit, me as advertising, I think about things uh, like that a lot. But I'm starting to figure out that I can listen to podcasts while I work on the engine as long as no one's here and as long as it's not playing in the background so I don't get a copyright strike. So let's get our uh, Game of Thrones on and clean down this engine. Check this out. Look how clean this is. It's so clean and I'm so excited. I took a photo and I sent it to all my friends and they were like, you've got a lot of work to do. And then they all sent screenshots of little images on the block. Like there, they're like, you can get that off. And there, I was like, I've been scrubbing that for probably 20 minutes and it's not getting better. And they're like, clean the blade. So like, that's a good point. So I went and got a new razor blade. So now I'm gonna try this again one more time. Um, but next step, I just found out, is to paint the block. 
if you guys have been following along the build series for a while, you know what color the block's gonna be. I'm still excited, no one else is excited, but I don't care, I like it. It's like Mountain Dew piss yellow. Hell yeah, brother. All right, back to, back to cleaning the block. All right, so you know how my friends just told me to use a new razor? Is that focus? Let's see if it's gonna focus. More of the stories that worked perfect and I got the last part of the grudge elf. So that's really good. Um, I think that's it right now. I think that's probably the end of this video. Next up is we're going to paint this. Um, but if it's not the end of the video, more to come. No.